Good day, YouTube. It's Friday. Just got home from work. I took my 15-minute nap. I asked my wife if she wanted to go out to dinner. She had, she was volunteering at her church all week, Monday through Thursday, with vacation Bible study in the evenings. Our granddaughter went to it. I said, hey, let's go out to dinner. She said, no, I'm tired of coming home and then leaving home. And she wants to cook. We're gonna relax, catch up on some shows, and enjoy the weekend. Maybe tomorrow we'll take her, I'll take her out. I was at work today. It's Friday, it's a good day. And I wanted, I wanted to share something with you that was on my mind. I am no different than most people in the sense that it is easy for this powerful mind to either be great or be horrible. I'm no different. I'll give you an example of how I caught myself today in a very simple example and it's good to be aware. It's good to balance your thinking. I am a resiliency instructor here and there for the Air Force, for the Space Force. I haven't done it in a while but I, I'm still up to the current standards of facilitating a class when I need to. So let me give you an example of what happened to me today. I'm at work and I went on my phone real quick to catch up on social media. I'm sure you know what that is because that is a huge thing in the world today in 2022. Social media, you're going to see what your friends are doing, what people you follow are doing, whether you know them or not. Friends, family, sometimes they're in great places vacationing. Sometimes it seems like they have the ideal life. And sometimes they do, sometimes they don't, but they're no different than myself or yourself. Here's my point. I'm quickly on social media and I see a celebration of someone and I'm thinking, ah, oh, man, it seems so exciting. That's real cool. And here I am at work and I quickly, that quick, caught myself. I was like, no, don't do that. So my question to you is, what are you celebrating today? You have something to celebrate just like I do. I live a great life, but I'm no different than anybody else in the sense that the mind can take me into whether it's doubt, insecurity, boredom, the grass is always greener over there when it's sometimes it is, sometimes it's not. But it doesn't really matter because I need to focus on my day, focus on my family, focus on my blessings. That is my message. So what are you celebrating today? What do you have to celebrate? Find it. Some people are going to say, oh, I'm down and out. Well, that happens. That happens to most of us, if not all of us. And I am no different. But I guarantee you there is something that you can celebrate today. You just have to find it and say, oh, I'm so fortunate for this. And I hope you're aware of that. The grass isn't always greener. Next time you catch yourself looking at someone's social media or life in person and you are bummed out because it may seem like they, they have it better than you do, catch that. That is called balance your thinking. You have to catch that. You have to be aware of that. And then you can get back on track and say, nope. I am blessed to have my health. Last night I went to sleep at about 10.30. My wife was going to sleep. I said, I'm going with you. She said, you are, why? Usually I stay up to about 11, 15, 11.30, so I tire myself out so I can go to sleep better. But my knees were hurting. That is a problem of getting older in life, is health. So you youngsters out there, be aware that your health is the best gift that you may have, that you have to take care of yourself. People look at me and say, he's slim. He, he can eat whatever he wants. And for the most part, I can. I have a very high metabolism, fast metabolism. But I also have to take care of myself, my innards. I don't want to have clogged arteries. I can't run anymore. My knees hurt. I went to sleep last night and I was awake 15 minutes later and I almost got up. But I stayed in bed and I just forced myself to stay there. I was tired. It was towards the end of the week and my knees were hurting. And I woke up today and you know what? If I don't know anything, my knees are good today. 
So I need to be thankful that my knees are good today, that they don't hurt like they did yesterday. But there's a lot more things that I'm blessed with, that I'm fortunate about, that I should be celebrating. And I wanted to take a moment to let you know that I hope you think the same way. And if you don't, change it, because that's called being human. We can go off on tangents, if, if that's the right word. So be aware of your blessings. Be aware of what you want to improve. Be aware of your successes. Be aware of your challenges and work on those challenges so you can have a good day, a good moment, a good life. Think about that. Have a great weekend. Take care.